You are welcome to another video of ISIS routing protocol concept and configuration. In this section, we'll talk about ISIS operation in broadcast network. In the previous section, we have seen that in ISIS routing protocol, each router advertises exactly one LSP to advertise its IP and topology information. But on the broadcast network, there is an additional LSP called SODO node LSP which is advertised by designated IS and is the topic of this section. To better understand the concept of ISIS database exchange and LSP packets in broadcast network, let's compare it again with OSPF in the first step. If you remember in OSPF, there is a router called DR or designated router whose main task is to advertise the broadcast network topology in addition, the database exchange between neighboring routers in the broadcast network is done through designated router and not one-to-one -one between every two neighboring routers. The multicast address 224.006 is reserved by designated router. All routers on the broadcast network send database information to designated router only by sending it to the, to the address 224.006 and designated router is responsible for advertising database information to all neighboring routers on the broadcast network by sending to the address 224.005 which all OSPF routers listen to and in this way the database information is advertised indirectly between all the routers of the broadcast network to ensure the correct operation of ospf in broadcast network there is another router called backup designated router which in addition to designated router also listens to the multicast address 6 as a backup and if designated router fails backup designated router replaces dr and a new bdr will be selected in ISIS protocol, there is also a router called designated IS whose naming similarity with designated router conveys the idea of same functionality of designated router and designated IS, but the fact is that there are also some differences between them. With ISIS, like OSPF, a router named designated IS is elected in broadcast network, but unlike OSPF, there is no backup router with the name of backup designated IS. And there is, in principle, no need for such a router. Why? In ISIS, there is no special multicast address for designated IS. If you remember, ISIS packets are encapsulated directly on data link layer and all ISIS level one packets are advertised to a special MAC address, which is written here, and all LSP level two packets are to are advertised to another MAC address. The designated IS router helps to unify the database of broadcast network routers in a different way. Designated IS router sends CSMP packet containing the list of database information every 10 seconds the timer is also configurable each of the routers within the broadcast network upon receiving csmp packet compare the information to its own database one of the following three situations occurs if csmp information is the same with routers database information the routers does not take any action because it means that the routers database is up to date. If the information in the routers database is not up to date, that router sent a request for LSP information that's not present in own database by sending PSMP. The lower sequence number indicates that the LSP is not up to date. If designated IS LSP sequence number is smaller than any of the routers in broadcast network. The router with highest sequence number send 
LSP and updates the designated IS database information. Therefore, designated IS rotor helps rotors ensure the database is up to date by regularly sending the list of database information. And if the database information of any of the broadcast network rotors or designated IS rotor is not up to date, they will update each other by sending LSP. If you remember, in point-to-point -point networks, after sending LSP, rotors acknowledge each other by sending PSMP packet. In broadcast network, no separate acknowledgement is sent from either rotors or designated IS rotor. But rotors are informed of their database status with receiving CSMP sent periodically by designated IS rotor. If any of the rotors on the broadcast network have an out-of-date database, they request it by sending PSMP. If the database of designated IS rotor is not up-to-date, normal rotor on the broadcast network will send an LSP to update designated IS rotor's database. The question is, how is designated IS rotor selected in a broadcast network? To select designated IS, the following steps are performed or checked in order. A rotor whose interface priority in a broadcast network has a higher value is selected as designated IS. The range of priority in the interface is from 0 to 127 and all values are valid. This is unlike OSPF protocol where a value of zero in the priority means that the rotor should not be designated rotor or backup designated rotor. We will use ISIS priority command in the interface context to configure the priority of ISIS in the broadcast network. The priority value can be configured separately for level one and level two, as we will see in a few minutes. If the priorities are the same, in the second step, the rotor with the largest SMPA will be selected as designated IS. If you remember, SMPA address in CLNS network is a layer two address tied to each interface. For Ethernet, SMPA is the MAC address of the interface and for Framelay and ATM network is the value of DLCI or VPI, VCI. And in the third step, since the rotors in Framelay and ATM networks can have the same DLCI or VPI, VCI address in the same broadcast network, the rotor in the third step with the largest system ID takes on the role of designated IS. Designated IS selection in ISIS, unlike designated rotor in OSPF, is preemptive. This means that any rotor with better conditions can take over the role of designated IS at any time. In ISIS, there is no backup designated IS concept because, as mentioned earlier, designated IS rotor in the ISIS routing protocol does not have the central role of sending database information between rotors in the broadcast network. And only by periodically sending the list of database information helps the rotors to ensure that their database information is up to date. At any time, any rotor can play the role of designated IS rotor. Designated IS rotor announce its health by periodically sending hello every 3.3 seconds, which is one third of hello time. And if no hello is received from designated IS during hello time, another rotor will immediately replace the designated IS rotor. But designated IS rotor plays another important role similar to OSPF, the designated IS rotor is responsible for sending the broadcast network topology to other rotors. Otherwise, each rotor on the broadcast network must advertise 
its connection to each of the other routers on the same broadcast network using a separate TLV. Then it requires each router to send n minus 1 TLV and a total of n multiply n minus 1 TLVs. But in ISIS protocol, designated IS routers send a sodo node LSP to introduce all routers of the broadcast network and each router in the network only send a TLV within the LSP pointing to the sodo node LSP. In the figure on the left, six routers shown that are connected in the same broadcast network. On the top right of the figure, you see if each router wants to show its connection to other routers in the network, a high number of TLVs must be sent, which turns the topology into a full mesh connection between all routers in the broadcast network. The right and bottom part of the figure shows the real operation of ISIS routing protocol where designated IS router advertise the broadcast network topology. The number of TLVs sent by designated IS router correspond to the number of routers connected in the broadcast network. The information that is advertised by designated IS router and shows the topology of broadcast network is called SODO node LSP. Each of the other routers on the broadcast network send only one TLV which indicates the connection to the broadcast network. Therefore, in broadcast networks, there is an additional LSP named SODO node LSP. This LSP is an addition to the router LSP that each router send separately. SODO net LSP is sent by designated IS router only. It is reminded that each LSP is identified by system ID, SODO node ID, and LSP fragment number. Also remember that each router address it interfaces through a single byte called circuit ID. In router LSP, system ID value is the same as router ID and the SODO node ID is zero. But in SODO node LSP, which is advertised by designated IS, the system ID value is the ID of designated IS router and SODO node ID is also the circuit ID of designated IS router interface connected in the broadcast network. To better understand the database exchange process in broadcast network and SODO node LSP in ISIS routing protocol, we configure ISIS in this topology and examine the result. In this topology, there are four routers from router one to router four. They are connected to each other through a broadcast network and all are in the same subnet 192.168.1, SH24. A loopback interface is configured for each router in the range of 172.16, in which the set octet is the router number. Net address are configured in the area one, and the system ID equal to to the router number one, three, two, and four. Interface connected to the router one is configured with a higher priority with the ISIS priority command. In the interface context, to force the router one to be designated IS. By default, the priority of interface are 64 and you can configure the priority per level 1 and level 2. I have already copied the configuration. In the first step we use the command show ISIS host name to check the list of the routers, the value of system ID and the corresponding host name. Then we use show ISIS neighbors in router 1 to list 
the neighbors as you can see rotor one has three neighbors rotor two three and four but the circuit id of all neighboring rotors in the broadcast network is equal to the circuit id value of designated is rotor in this topology the rotor one is the designated is rotor because of the priority configuration then with command show ISIS neighbor details, we can see SMPA address as well as priority value of each rotor. For example, for rotor 2, the priority is 64 and SMPA address the MAC address of the rotor 2 in the broadcast network. And this is also true for rotor 3 and rotor 4. But as you know, the priority of rotor 1 is configured as 100. You can check it, for example, in rotor 2 with a command. Show ISIS neighbor detail for the rotor 1. The priority, as you can see, is 100. By using the command show ISIS database in rotor 1, show ISIS database, you can see the summary of rotor 1 database table. As you can see, there are five LSP in the rotor one. Each rotor has sent exactly one rotor LSP, and the other is SODO node LSP, which is sent by designated IS rotor. The SODO node ID of all rotor LSP is zero, except for SODO node. LSP whose SODO node ID is equal to circuit ID of designated IS rotor. In this scenario, the SODO node ID of the SODO node LSP sent by designated IS is 0, 1. And the fragment number of all LSP is 0 because only one packet is sent for each LSP. To view the details of LSPs in rotor 1, we can use the details keyword at the end of this command. As you can see in the output, all rotors have sent the network 192.168.1 in the advertising LSP. Also, all rotors announced their connection to the broadcast network by sending a common TLB of IS type that points to the SODO node LSP. It's also true for all other rotors. The SODO node LSP is IOU101, which is sent by designated IS rotor, IOU1, showing the list of rotors in the broadcast network. And all other rotors, only send one TLV pointing to the SODO node LSP, which is here the list of the other 